It's like the federal judge in the Dinesh D'Souza filmmaker case. They played a clip of Fox News and a clip of my show. This is in the transcripts of the judge's ruling. Where D'Souza said, I'm being set up and being politically persecuted. And the judge said, because you did that, I'm going to give you an eight-month sentence. Locked up one of these little mega prisons. But Orwellian style, they don't call it a prison. So he escaped jail time. The headlines were total bull. Oh, you're not a political prisoner. We're just going to lock you up for eight months and make you go to psychological therapy to cure you directly out of the Soviet Union. And five years probation. And the judge said, we're not political, but you went and spoke out. So we're going to throw the book at you. And don't worry, MSNBC has come out and said that Eric Holder was never political. That's right. And the Jolly Green Giant isn't green. The Hulk is green, folks. Whenever I said two plus two equals four, my son said, no, I get it. The Hulk is green. And that's what we're faced with. How dare you, how dare you say that we should look at vaccines as damaging people and look at the studies? How dare you say we're becoming fascist? So the big vaccine makers and others are going to get together and use Facebook and Twitter to hammer his sponsor and to get him kicked off the air. Well, the answer to this is anyone who has State Farm, to do it, to not be lazy, to call State Farm and say, listen, I'm not going to argue with you. I just want, you know, in an email and a call, I'm going to switch my insurance now. I'm not going to be lazy, and I'm going to go off State Farm because State Farm is allowing people to be punished for their clearly legitimate and, and tasteful political speech, saying America is becoming a fascist system and America needs to look at vaccines. There is a mystery illness all over the United States, and even NBC News admits it's linked to vaccinated kids. I mean, should I be thrown off the air for saying that? So <clears throat> later in the broadcast, bottom of the hour, I'm going to get into this in detail. Gary Webb confirmed, targeted by a mockingbird operation, that's government-run media, to be destroyed before they killed him to stop his book coming out. And I was talking to Freeway Ricky Ross. I was talking to Gary Webb four or five months before he died. And Gary said, I want to come on your show when this happens. I want you to, uh, he sent me a disc. It was just of news articles and clippings and things. Uh, nothing secret. Uh, you know, I want you to build a Dark Alliance website for me. Uh, I want you to put these documents up. I said, sure, I'll help you. Well, don't do it till, till I'm ready. My book proves it all and more, how the big banks run it all. He, he was on, I mean, the government was listening. They heard the call. How he discovered that, that the whole thing is run, not just cocaine. We know that from Sibel Edmonds and other NSA whistleblowers, the, the white slavery, everything. And they shot him twice in the head. And here it all is. The L.A. Times is being interviewed with the reporters saying, I'm sorry I worked with the CIA to discredit him. I feel bad about it now. Oh, you feel bad about it now? You feel bad? But it's like, oh, the CIA is here. Oh, yes, sir. Let me discredit someone because you said so. Oh, the FBI is here. Yes, you're the good guys. Let me salute you. Oh, bring in the toady jury for the federal trial with 90 plus percent conviction rates who would literally send the two-year-old to the gas chamber of order to. Let's bring in these hand-picked controlled bunch of perps who've all been blackmailed by the feds, these kept juries. Let's bring in some federal juries to convict whoever we say. By the way, I said a 90 plus. I think it's a 97% conviction rate in this country. Do you believe in any country? Only places like North Korea have 97% conviction rates and the U.S. Do you understand that? Totally illegitimate, totally criminal, totally fraudulent. And now, though, it hadn't eaten the country yet. This foreign takeover hasn't had the big butchering of the hog yet. They're just building up with the vehicles, the armored bases, the training, the preparations, the psychological warfare, the Internet kill switches, the takeover grids. And they're just trying to get the military and police 
in line for the final takeover when they set the nukes off, shoot up the churches and schools, and blame it on the liberty movement. They're just getting ready for the mega false flag. You know about RVs, you've heard about bunkers, but surviving is not recreation. And man wasn't made to live underground. Introducing Survivalist Camps, the ultimate fully functional off-the-grid survival bug-out house that's mobile, well-equipped, and custom-built to outlast any other RV or trailer. Go to survivalistcamps.com to learn more. That's survivalistcamps.com, providing your basic needs to survive. Survivalistcamps.com. My Magic Mud is a tooth whitening powder that removes plaque and detoxifies your mouth. It's safe for your enamel, giving you a beautiful polish and a dentist light clean after every use. My Magic Mud is also the perfect remedy for pain caused by sensitivity. It strengthens your teeth and gums for a strong, healthy smile. The ingredients are 100% natural and it's safe for children. Simply brush with My Magic Mud right before bedtime for a cleaning you can count on. Visit MyMagicMud.com. Listen up. GCN Live teams with Prepper and Shooter Magazine to offer an amazing exclusive deal. Be one of the first 1,000 listeners to visit GCNlive.com and click the Prepper and Shooter image. Then receive a free issue of Prepper and Shooter Magazine. Choose the third issue with rock legend Mark Farner from Grand Funk Railroad on the cover and get the first two issues absolutely free. This exclusive offer ends September 30th, so get your free issue of Prepper and Shooter now. Only at GCNlive.com. Hey, Boomer! I learned in school today that 60% of our bodies are made of water. Good thing we have the Berkey system. It's the cleanest, best water ever. Mom says it's because the Berkey's filtration system cleans out the bad stuff and leaves only pure, delicious water. I know, right? You love it, too. Yeah, I'm thirsty, too. Let's go get some. Get Berkey clean water by calling 877-886-3653. That's 877-886-3653. Or visit GoBerkey.com. You've heard about the essential qualities of iodine when it comes to your well-being, and you've read the opinions of top experts regarding this good member of the halogen family. Still, reports indicate that iodine is absent in sufficient amounts from the daily lives of countless people worldwide. Now, our extra strength new nascent iodine formula is here. Survival Shield X2, leading the way into the next generation of super high quality nascent iodine. InfoWars Life Survival Shield X2 is derived from 200 plus million year old salt solutions found more than 7,000 feet below the Earth's surface. The result is a unique nascent iodine that is both concentrated and free of unwanted additives, genetically modified ingredients, and completely vegan. We even pre-screen our Survival Shield X2 iodine for radiation. Pure, clean, and sourced from deep within the Earth, X2 nascent iodine is available exclusively at InfoWarsLife.com, InfoWarsStore.com, or call 1-888-253-3139. A 30-day GMO-free emergency food supply for only $99 at 30dayfoodsupply.com. You can purchase Oregon Trail Foods' one-month supply of high-quality, nutritious, and healthy emergency meals. For less than $100, these vegetarian meals are naturally high in fiber, carbs, and protein, and they're packed with oxygen absorbers in Mylar pouches. They're completely free of any artificial flavors and colorings, have a 20-year shelf life, and take up to 70% less space than number 10 cans. They even offer a gluten free option. Oregon Trail Foods and 30dayfoodsupply.com keep prices low by buying directly from the producers in Oregon and then passing the savings to you. Purchase a 30-day 90-serving emergency food supply for only $99 this month and $10 ships your entire order. Visit the website at 30dayfoodsupply.com or call 541-229-0010. That's 30dayfoodsupply.com where they make preparedness affordable. 30dayfoodsupply.com. Alex Jones here back live. If you just joined us, I was getting into um, some articles that I'm going to read in part coming up in the next segment and detail exactly how they operate in the culture of total dishonor. But what blew my dad away was is that the Homeland Security person that came to visit him, and my dad called and the person was, quote, with Homeland Security, was so unprofessional and so ridiculous Kind of like a Barney Fife meets Hitler. In that he didn't even know that David Jones was Alex Jones's father. And see, my dad thought it was some setup or something to get him to go to Homeland Security meetings and that they knew who he was. And I said, no, 
they're going to make the dog catcher a CIA agent. Because it gives all these weak-minded people incredible confidence to commit all sorts of un-American activities to just give them their little InfraGuard card. And, and they got a lot of well-meaning people involved 12, 13 years ago after 9-11 for the terror threat of Al-Qaeda. But we were pointing out who really ran Al-Qaeda and, and allowed them to attack bare minimum. But once they got the pump primed, we were sent the syllabuses. We, we published them eight, nine years ago of farming communities. And, and it was later in the Associated Press where they would get them to a local hotel, all the old farmers and ranchers, and they'd show them Al-Qaeda training videos for the first 10 minutes while they had donuts and coffee. Then they'd shift to, is your neighbor growing marijuana? Do they spank their kids? Uh, are they green? Did they build a barn they weren't supposed to? And all these old timers would go, what in the world? It's some kind of commie meeting. So they get you in. Come on in, we're going to fight Al-Qaeda. <laughs> and you get in there and they're like, here's the enemy. Veterans, gun owners, returning, uh, retired police, you name it. Anybody that might be able to fight a fascist takeover. With socialism at the grassroots, I just got chills. Because here's Reuters today. U.S. Homeland Security moves to tackle climate change and to begin criminal prosecution of people that drop a battery in your yard, that don't recycle. Remember the Audi Green Police ads five years ago at the Super Bowl? Show people being arrested for their hot tub being too hot. And then I said, that's real. In areas of Europe, they've already banned toasters and, 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 and barbecue pits and space heaters. And they're already arresting people uh, who have too big a hot tub or have the wrong light bulbs. And then the mayor came out with the head of the PR firm where they made the Audi commercial, the Green Police Audi commercial, in the San Francisco Chronicle and said, this is what we're going to do. We're putting out social messages to prepare you for the new way. See, when I say that ad's real, I knew it was a PR propaganda piece before it was admitted. Not because I'm even smart. I know what these people are up to. I've watched them so long. Austin, New York City, San Francisco are going to raise property taxes and regulations to where a 250-square-foot apartment is going to be $10,000 a month. They're in Community Impact, that's the local Agenda 21 brainwashing progressive free newspaper that sells prosperity through this, saying macro problem, micro solution. Tiny apartment concept gains interest from city officials. So they'll give the developers a free ride on taxes and stuff, and Bloomberg's involved, for these literal prison complexes, 250 square foot. Notice this says smaller than 400 square feet. Yeah, the biggest ones, the penthouses in these facilities are 350. The smallest are 100. Literal coffins. They're building them downtown right now. Big ones. And listen, it's not so you could, you've got more discretionary income. If you read the actuaries on all this, they're on record saying that way they get more taxes. It, it, it's so you live on less so they get more. Actual highway checkpoints, green police checkpoints, are now being set up in Austin. Four or five years ago, they had it as the ad. The green police, we're coming after you. In fact, let's go out to break with the green police. It, it's, it's the only jobs in America. The number one tuitions now being paid for, scholarships, are spying on people. And you're like, but where are the terrorists? No, 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 it's a criminal takeover. They're coming after everybody. Nazi Germany? Heard of that before? Soviet Russia? This is it. We got cancer, folks. It's real. It's a horrible case. Only freaking out and breaking with these people will stop it. Let's go out to break with the Green Police ad. Restart it. It's unbelievable. Or we can come back after break with the Green Police uh, ad for folks. We can just play the whole thing. 